Hello everyone, welcome back to part 2 of this replay between Shy and Lin. Right now Shy has a potion of invulnerability being used on that demon hunter at a very very low 46 hit points right now. So um, I'm, a, I'm hoping that he transfers the Staff of Preservation to the Tinker or to the Beastmaster perhaps and then continues this pressure right now as Lin is sitting at 37 over 50 and pretty much out of position at this point. Shy is sitting at 46 over 50 so even um, he's just being able to force back a lot of these units a low hit point. Um, I'm not sure what unit that is. Yeah, let's see, can I see? Uh, it is a low hit point grunt right there. And now I'm going to go ahead and continue this replay right now. We have the, the and Demon Hunter now trying to push back out. The Staff of Preservation being transferred to the Beastmaster. Uh, Demon Hunter trying to run back away right now. Staff of Preservation being used. And um, Hawk up in the air. And now... Let's see, um, we have Shy trying to continue in the fight. Um, Lin pretty much out of mana on that Torrent Chieftain, so not really much to worry about there. Blade Master up in the air. Down goes one Drew to the Talon. Torrent Chieftain trying to do some chasing right now. Goblin Tinker dropping another... No, not going to drop a Pocket Factory. A little bit surprised by that, as th the Pocket Factory would be a good call at this point. Beastmaster down to 282 hit points. Maybe force to use a Squirrel Town Portal. Uh, is he going to be able to use it? Down to 51 hit points right now. And uh, Down to 40 hit points. And, oh, there. Squirrel Town Portal at 14 hit points. Very, very nicely done. Very dangerous, in fact. And now Tool Talon Portal heads back out. So right now we have Druids of the Talon and that Demon Hunter now coming back. And the Druids of the Talon will have to wait to join that fight. And Beastmaster sitting at level 2 has no additional Moon Juice to really drink from at this point. So um, perhaps is going to use um, an, a Moonstone in order to get some additional Moon Wells. Oh wow, able to heal back up about halfway. On that Beastmaster, picking up a Clarity Potion and also picking up a Potion of Healing in order to get, um, in order to prolong that next fight. Right now, the um, Orc player Lin now trying to engage these um, Ogre Lords over here. Torn Chieftain sitting at level 2, Blade Master sitting at level 3. In snare off on that Ogre Lord. Ogre Lord taking a lot of damage. Ogre Lord not able to really turn back around. And that's such a cheesy way for the Orc players to not have to deal with the high damage on that Ogre Lord. Pulling back and using that Raider and snare. Very nicely done. Um, right now we have uh, Beastmaster coming back in, re rejoining Goblin Tinker at level 1, um, Demon Hunter at level 3, plus 14 attack, especially with that plus 9 clause of attack right now. And um, Shy most likely wanting to get an, an additional potion um, that, oh, very nicely done. Big um, Blade Master stealing that kill and getting that potion of greater healing. So Blade Master and also using that potion of invulnerability, now going after those Druids of the Talon. Druid of the Talon taking a couple hits, mana burn off on that Blade Master. Blade Master now running back away once again. Level 4 Gigantuan Sea Turtle up in the air. And now we have Shy um, trying uh, pur purchasing a scroll of healing and re-engaging right now. Torrent Chieftain sitting at level three right now. Double circuit to nobility and command aura and endurance aura on that Torrent Chieftain. So that Torrent Chieftain is an aura fiend right now, making all those units attack faster, deal more damage right now. Uh, Ah, I need to stop saying right now, excuse me. A Spirit Walker is still trying to move off into the north-hand side. Beastmaster trying to engage Demon Hunter, taking down one of those Orc Burrows with ease right now. Hawk is up in the air, and that Blade Master is revealed. And down goes one of those Druids of the Talon, but Ensnare is now ha happening all over the place. The Spirit Walker is trying to cast and disenchant, disenchanting um, a lot of those attacks. Down goes a, a, what, a Druid of the Talon due to a nice long-distance shockwave. A lot of units just up in the air at this point. Got Pocket Factory now being dropped in, dropped in. And now more disenchant. So Druids of the Talon trying to fight back. Shockwaves hitting. Lin doing a really good job on this fight right now. I must say, this is this is quite surprising. Lin is sitting at 55 over 50, so upside down on the food count. But a lot of those Spirit Links... And wow, this, this fight is going very well for... Lin. I'd have to say this fight's going well for Lin at this point. Torrent Chieftain sitting at... Um, at 500 hit points, is going to probably buy a potion of healing and a potion of mana and try to um, start shockwaving more of these units. Um, all, all this may be for not as um, Torrent Chieftain now buying the potion of mana, going to get off a shockwave, trying to chase down, yeah, hitting a lot of those units once again. And I think Shy had just thrown away this game. This game is looking so good for Lin at this point. Level 4 in dirt, or level 2 on that, or level 4 on that, um, Torrent Chieftain level 2 aura now in play. Pocket Factory now getting focused down. And now Lin continuing to do a great job fighting right now. Lin is sitting at 49 over 50. Has lost some additional units. Torrent Chieftain or Beastmaster sitting at level 2. Is going to have to use that Potion of Invulnerability. Is he going to be able to use it? Able to use it again at 48 hit points. And now the Demon Hunter is continuing to try to fight back. But wow, what a, what a change in advance right now. Shy down to a 38 over 50 f a food army while resurrecting that Goblin Tinker. So down to a 33 food army. Meanwhile, Lin sitting pretty well at 49 over 50. So that fight went really well for Lin. Um, 
yeah, I don't know what to say. I thought Shy had this game. He he was playing so well, and I hate it when this happens. Why does that happen? Anyways, right now we have a, a, a demon hunter trying to engage. Perhaps trying to try to do some more creeping right now. And we have um, uh, we have this hawk up in the air and trying to engage Druid to the Talon. Going to start focusing down that um, Ogre Lord. Ogre Lord now running back, taking some damage over time due to that poison. Blade Master are going to come in, and oh, this is not good right now. Lin going to catch off guard, and then, oh, nice Cyclone. Both of those units up in the air. Disenchant and that Ogre Lord. Whoever gets that last hit is going to be important. Torrent Chieftain gets a Shockwave off on it to get that very nicely done. Jangle Endurance Auras, and I think, I, we had the, yeah, the Demon Hunter went down, so Shy. Do it, playing a great first half is now losing it all of a sudden. And uh, Beastmaster is going to get to level 3. So the, the lo level 3 Quill Beast will be very important. Level 2 Goblin Tinker right now. But yeah, things just not looking good right now. Lin uh, getting that um, Warsong Battle Drums. Is that Jangle Endurance Aura? Oh, no, sold that uh, sold that aura right there. So there's only two auras right there. And Blade Master continuing the fight. Blade Master getting once again shocked, uh, thrown up into the air. Drew to the Talon, once again getting focused back down. Another, oh, very nicely done. Using that Staff of Preservation the second before the Raider gets an ensnare off. And now that the Beastmaster getting focused down. Beastmaster is in trouble. Yeah, getting ensnared once again. Probably wish he could Cyclone his own unit at this point. Unable to, Beastmaster goes down. And Shy's going to have to say GG. Lin is has just come back with a vengeance at this point. Those Jews of the Talon not able to deal enough damage. Um, no grunts, nothing with heavy armor. So um, those raiders able to um, shake off a lot of that damage. And Shy loses this game. Um, yeah, great play by Lin. Lin keeping his focus and taking this game. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, it was a classic Night Elf versus Orc, but I've never seen... That was a great comeback from Lin. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Um, yeah, and keep, you know, stay tuned to my YouTube channel in order to watch more replays. Thanks again.